morning. Uh, Dr. Athar is here. So today my topic is uh, a parabola. In this lecture, uh, I will first of all I will define the parabola, and uh, we will discuss the construction of parabola, and uh, the parabola in two in the parabola in two things: the parabola with vertex at origin, the parabola vertex at any point except the origin. And after this, uh, we will discuss some problems regarding parabola. And after this, in the end, I will tell you about the application, how we can apply the parabola in our daily life. So let's start now. Very simple thing. What is parabola? Set of points, set of all points in a plane, equidistance from focus. See, equidistance from focus and equidistance from directrix. So the direct focus is fixed point and the directrix is fixed line. So this is called parabola. So uh, in mathematically, mathematically we, we can define parabola as a quadratic function, which is ax square plus bx plus c is equal to zero. So this is parabola. And uh, parabola, I told you there are two things in parabola. Parabola when the vertex at origin. So see, uh, this is a focus, okay? This is focus. This is our vertex because vertex at origin 0, 0 and uh, this is focus and this is any point A and this is directrix. I told you any point set of points equidistance from fixed point and from fixed line. This is called parabola. So this is a uh, focus and this is directrix and this is vertex. I already told you that the directrix is 0. So uh, in other case, when the parabola vertex at any point hk, this is parabola c, uh, this is our x-axis and this is uh, y-axis, this is origin, but here ex except origin, this is vertex hk and uh, you observe that the coordinate of focus hk plus p, why, what reason? Actually, you know, this is x, x coordinate and there is no change in x coordinate because we are going towards the y direction. So that's why no change in x. So y is k plus p because the distance is p. And similarly, same thing is, same thing is down towards the uh, uh, directrix. This is y is equal to k minus p. So this distance from a uh, focus to a uh, vertex p and focus to directrix, this is p. So total is 2p. So uh, uh, now I will tell you in detail the parabola with vertex at origin. So uh, at origin, the first thing is parabola along x-axis and parabola along y-axis. So how you can say parabola along x-axis? Because simple thing is if x power 1, if x is linear, your parabola will be about x-axis. How you can recognize your parabola on the towards right direction or open towards the left direction? How you can recognize? It's very simple thing. If x is linear, your parabola will be open towards right. If f, p is negative, your parabola will be open towards left direction. And this is focus and this is vertex. Vertex is zero. I already told you that in this case. And this is directrix. And other thing is that parabola along y-axis parabola along y-axis. So similarly, two case, parabola along y-axis mean parabola open towards up, open towards down. How you can, we can uh, recognize the parabola in which case parabola open towards up or open towards down depend upon P. If P is positive, your parabola along y-axis. If P is negative, your parabola towards down. So this is uh, uh, parabola vertex at origin. Again, I tell you the parabola vertex at origin, the two things along x-axis, along y-axis, x-axis, again two things, if p is positive, your parabola open towards right, if p is negative, your parabola towards left, if y along, if y is power 1, y is linear, your parabola about y-axis, it depends upon p. If p is positive, your parabola open towards up. If p is negative, your parabola open towards down. So next case is parabola with vertex at any point along x-axis. So see, 
this is uh, x axis and this is y axis and this is any point. Uh, last time, uh, you know, in previous slide you observed h k, but here h plus p and k. So, why what season? Because going towards the uh, x direction, this parabola along x axis. Again, I am telling you that now we are discussing the parabola along x axis. So, this is uh, k will be same because you are changing toward the x axis. So, that is why h plus p. Similarly, uh, if we are going towards the up, now the change in x and change in y, h plus p and k plus 2p. Why 2p? The reason is that the distance from focus to directrix and direct focus to vertex and this is p and vertex to directrix this is p. So, total distance 2p. So, that is why this distance and this distance will be 2p will be same. So, this is a parabola vertex at any point h k along x axis. Now, parabola with vertex at any point along y axis. The same thing is this is the standard form of parabola y minus k square is equal to 4 p x minus h. If x is linear, your parabola will be uh, uh, about x axis. If y is linear, your parabola will be about y axis. So, similarly, uh, here h k and this is focus h. Now, we are going towards the up. So, h will be same the change in uh, y direction k plus p. Here we are going toward left direction changing in x. So, h coordinate will be changed because here h. So, here h plus p. Here we are going towards y towards uh, y, y axis. So, change in you observe that uh, y coordinate. So, this is parabola. In short, this parabola with vertex at any point along x axis depend upon the p. If p is positive, your parabola open towards right direction. p is negative, your parabola open towards left direction. And here along y axis, in case of y axis, if y power 1, you should keep in mind if y power 1, your parabola will be uh, uh, along y axis. And if depend upon the p, if p is positive, your parabola open towards the up and p is negative open towards the down. So, this is the construction of parabola. Now, we will discuss the some problem regarding parabola. Let us start now. Uh, focus, we have to, equation is given, it is very simple thing, equation is given. Uh, y square is equal to 6x. We have to find the focus. We have to find the directrix. No need to find the vertex because in this case vertex is 0, 0. And after this we will draw the graph. So, very simple thing. Y square is equal to 6x. 6x. X, x, x is linear. It confirmed that our parabola will be about x axis. And how you can understand along positive direction or negative direction is very simple way. Plus 6x it means our parabola open towards right direction. So, uh, how you can find the p is very simple way. y square is equal to 6x. What is the standard form called parabola? y square is equal to 4px. So, by comparing you will get 4p is equal to 6 and you will get p is equal to 3 by 2. So, uh, what is your, so what is your focus in this case? 3 by 2, 0 because p 0, so p is 3 by 2. So, now we, I can draw here easily. You can see they here. Uh, this is 1 and this is 2. This is 3 by 2. Okay, This is focus and from vertex same, same uh, distance, but, but will be minus 3 by 2. So, this is our parabola. Uh, the, the equation is given. We, ha we, we, find, we, we can find easily directrix and focus and we can draw the graph easily. And uh, other problem? Other problem is that a uh, parabola with vertex at any point. So, very simple thing focus is given minus 2, 1 and directrix is minus 6. Let us draw the uh, uh, this point on the uh, table. In this way, we can easily resolve the problem. So, let us uh, see here and uh, this is vertex. Uh, this is vertex. We have to find the vertex, it is not given. So, focus is given. So, what is this minus 2, 1? So, this is a focus minus 2, 1 and this is directrix. Uh, 
how you can find the vertex is very very simple way see from here to vertex and vertex to this how much uh, total uh, you can say distance so this is 2 this is minus 6 so midpoint very simple way just find the midpoint minus 6 plus minus 2 and divide by 2 you will get minus 4 so and this is uh, no change in uh, y y will be same is 1 uh, uh, obviously here the vertex k will be 1 so your vertex is minus 4 and 1 this is the coordinate of vertex and I already told you that because uh, here in this case in this case the pair the directis x is minus 6 so you should another thing I tell you that the directis always opposite where the open for example the parabola open towards right direction you always your directis will be uh, towards uh, opposite direction if parabola towards up the directis will be opposite direction in this opposite direction so uh, this is open uh, towards right so this is directrix and what about the focal length p is equal to 2 how we can observe p is equal to 2 I already, to, uh, I already told you that this is from here to here the uh, distance is 2 the distance because distance always positive okay should keep in mind distance area length should be always positive so that's why our this is minus 2 from here to here this minus 2 so that's why the focal length will be p is equal to 2 yeah, in short similar a uh, very simple way you can say that p mod so minus 2 mod for example so you, it will you get p2 so this is the standard form of uh, quartic uh, uh, the parabolic equation y minus k square is equal to 4p x minus h now we, we already find each and everything you know so now just put here what is k this given yes yeah, we found already and what is h this is uh, minus 4 what is k this is 1 p is equal to 2 so y minus 1 square is equal to 4 p x minus or uh, yeah, this is minus 4 so y minus 4 square, y minus 1 square is equal to 8 x plus 4 so this is the problem regarding parabola when vertex at any point and in this case in this case uh, the our uh, parabola open towards right so now uh, now I'm talking about the application there are a lot of applications of parabola in our daily life in, in our nature there are a lot of application I can't uh, discuss each and every application in limited time but uh, just I will tell you uh, the some uh, application regarding first of all the, uh, the application regarding uh, bridges I uh, see you observed that you observed uh, there are a lot of bridges that are very famous bridges in the world you observed so why the bridges is parabolic form why the you see or you observe the cable why the cable is a lot uh, just like a parabolic form what reason behind this is very very important thing is that the parabolic shape help ensure that the bridge stay up the bridge should be stay up and the cable the cable can sustain the weight of thousands of car and trucks in each hour so this is the advantage of parabolic cables and parabolic bridges this is the advantage of because on daily basis thousands of car they, they can cross the bridge and trucks so they are with a huge weight so that's why this uh, parabolic uh, cable helps uh, to sustain the weight so our other application is very uh, common application we can see in our daily life on daily basis in our car you observe the headlights we use the parabolic reflector why use the parabolic reflector what 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 reason actually the parabolic reflector is a reflector reflective surface used to collect or to project just like light sound or radio waves this is the this is the uh, advantage of parabolic reflector we use in our car in headlights and uh, another application is very very important thing in our life satellite antenna radar so in all over the world you observed all the satellite antenna and radar they follow the parabolic form see you observed this is the parabolic surface here the vertex and this is the focus 
why we use why you the parabolic form actually you observe that if any waves strike on the this uh, parabolic surface immediately he will shift this way towards the uh, focus so in this way they can detect easily the signals coming from anywhere they easily can uh, detect the signal this is the advantage of parabolic the parabolic antenna satellite antenna should be in the parabolic form this is the advantage another thing is that uh, another thing if we in even in a, a basketball game you know you observe a person want to uh, throw the basketball he want to put the ball in the basket he, ha he has to follow the uh, the, the application of parabola see they are the, in this case because if the first case and second case and third case you observe that nothing nothing but in this he will success why because very this path is very close to parabolic path so that's why and uh, when you many time observe the um, uh, fountain the water flow you follow the uh, parabolic form so this is the application of applic uh, uh, parabola i told you there are a lot of application but in the limited time i can't uh, explain each and everything uh, regarding the uh, applications so in short again i summarize i want to summarize my topic what is parabola parabola is a set of points equidistant from a fixed point and from a fixed line this set of point is called parabola parabola there are two things the when vertex at origin vertex at any point except origin and uh, parabola there are two things if x power 1 your parabola about will be about x axis if y power 1 y is linear your parabola uh, about y axis if in x axis if p positive your parabola open towards right direction if para p is negative your parabola towards the left direction in case of y if p is positive your parabola open will be towards up if p is negative your parabola open towards down so this is my lecture okay thank you